a royal commission, a pioneering visionary and an extraordinary artwork. This is the story of the Solbay Tapestry. The Solbay Tapestry is a unique example of English tapestry weaving. It was purchased for Royal Museums Greenwich with the assistance of the Art Fund in 1968. But it requires urgent conservation. We're asking for your help to raise £15,000 to save the Solbay Tapestry and bring it home to Greenwich where it was first designed 350 years ago. The tapestry depicts the Battle of Solbay, the first naval engagement of the Third Anglo-Dutch War of 1672. The tapestry was commissioned by Charles II shortly after the battle. He requested the marine artist Willem van der Velde the Elder to draw up the designs, which he did here in the Queen's House in Greenwich. Van der Velde was a pioneering marine artist and had himself been at the battle making sketches of the action. He was a kind of early photojournalist in a sense. The drawings were then used to weave a series of tapestries by a group of expert weavers in central London. Until now, the museum has been unable to display the tapestry because of its fragile state. It requires a new linen backing for support. The silk has degraded over time and requires stabilising, ensuring it's strong enough to be put on display. With your help, we will be able to conserve the Solbay tapestry. It will go on display in a landmark exhibition exploring the life and work of Willem van der Velde the Elder and his son Willem the Younger and their time working in their studio here in the Queen's House. It will look at their legacy and their defining influence on the culture of British maritime art and artists, including the great J.M.W. Turner. This is your chance to help save this iconic tapestry and tell the story of the birth of maritime art in Greenwich. Together, we can write the next chapter in the history of the Solvay Tapestry.